Hey guys, it's Sam, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be all about my e.l.f. lipstick from the Essential line. So basically, they are a doll. I will be swatching all of the ones that I own on my lips, plus I will give you a quick little review about them. about these lipsticks is that the color looks really good at least it will probably on camera but in person it is way too creamy like this literally feels like water on your lips but not in a good way not like so smooth no it's like am I putting oil on my lips that just feels disgusting but the color looks good except that in person you can see any like it's patchy like it doesn't go on like opaque everywhere so that's kind of a disappointment plus they break again so easily like there's no point of having this it's a dollar but it's gonna break pretty much the first use these lipstick are super creamy actually i think they are too creamy they kind of remind me of the nyx round lipstick so if you like those one you will like these but i feel like they go on so creamy and so pigmented that you can make easily a lot of mistakes so it's kind of a pain to apply plus if you drink or something, they are going to smudge like crazy. So not my favorite for that. But for a dollar, you get great pigmentation and you can really play and have fun. The colors are really nice too. They're so creamy that you're gonna end up with them on your teeth, on your forehead apparently. They do taste good, I have to say that. They smell like fruits and taste like fruits, but a little too creamy for my taste. 
They are kind of hit and miss for me because I feel like sometimes like the color is not evenly applied so you can have like spot you can see your lips and the other one is like super pigmented. So it's kind of disappointing but that's pretty much it. I do think they smell nice. Packaging is okay. The thing is that they are so inconsistent. One of them can be super creamy and opaque. One of them can be like kind of sheer. One of them can be like kind of patchy. The one I'm wearing right now is kind of a matte finish. Plus, they don't look whatsoever like the pictures online. Like, you really have to find someone doing swatches. That's one of the reasons I wanted to do the lip swatches because it's so hard to find pictures with the true color. So that's it, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you like lip swatch videos so I know to keep doing them. Don't forget to subscribe if it's not already done. And I will see you in my next video.